It's Superhero, and you know what to do. Well, it looks like I'm coming up on time where I'm going to have to either decide if I'm going to go on carousel or I'm going to run. But before I go, I thought I'd show you guys the latest version of Devlin and Associates LLC's DS Sleep Gun. Uh, the last video I made on these went so well that I thought I would make another one showing off the new version. The uh, one I bought initially was matte black. Now you can see they're going to make a gloss metallic black. I actually did this one myself and uh, they liked how well that it came out and it was easy enough to do, so they're gonna start offering the gloss black ones as well. You'll just have to choose when you order one from Devlin and Associates LLC on eBay which finish you want. See, I was able to do it even without interfering with the LED. And uh, another new feature that they added Remember in the last video that I made how uh, I pointed out how accurate and cool it was that the glow plug was here? Because the glow plug is actually what ignited the calcium carbide that was shot down the barrel to make it look like the gun was firing. Well, the only thing that was missing on this that kept it from being 100% film and show accurate was the little toggle switch here. Now, you see, what I was going to do, I wrote them and sent them a video showing that I was going to try and add my own toggle switch to it, which was going to be a cutting and puttying nightmare. So they said, don't worry about it, and went ahead and made the toggle switch. This will be a feature on every single one that they make now at Devlin & Associates LLC. Uh, as long as well as whether or not you choose matte or gloss finish and that brings them up to a hundred percent show accurate see they used to throw the toggle switch to heat up the glow plug to ignite the calcium carbide that came down the barrel to get the firing effect uh, I'm pretty sure that matte and gloss finish are both accurate uh, you see some of the ones like, uh, I think the ones that actually fire were gloss finish and the ones that were like rubber poured mock, you know, mock-ups, like a solid one piece rubber one that were used for the guys standing in the background and everything were matte finish. So either way you decide to go, you're accurate. But, uh, now I've got, you know, this one and the gloss finish, I'll take it outside and, uh, show you it in some proper light to show how good it looks in this kind of finish. Okay, here you can get a good look at it in some proper light. You can see it looks very metallic. It came out very well. Like I was saying inside, I did this one myself and uh, Devlin and Associates will start doing it following the pattern that I gave for them. I just took one of their matte black guns and added a uh, Krylon gloss black to it. It comes out a little tacky, but you let it sit for about 24 hours and then hit it with a Krylon gloss clear coat. That gets rid of all the tack that's on it. You can see it's not sticky at all. And uh, then you're done. And they'll offer both versions of it here shortly on eBay at Devlin & Associates LLC. Another interesting thing that I just found out from them, uh, the guns are 3D printed, but the handles that they use are actually made out of resin, and that is cool as hell, because that is added authenticity, as on the actual guns used in the movie and show, the handles were made out of resin as well. So. If you want that little added touch of realism, they make sure to provide it for you. So there you go. That's what it looked like in outdoor light to give you an idea of how cool and like oiled metal it looks when it's gloss coated. It's also very smooth and has a nice finish on it when it also has the matte finish. So just go ahead and pick whichever style you want when you 
order yours from Devlin and Associates LLC on eBay. That costs about a tenth of what a firing replica does, and it's cool and a heck of a lot safer. Also, when I went outside to uh, show you guys the footage of what it looks like in the sun, something weird happened. My crystal turned clear. Any of you guys know what that means? Oh well. Anyway, stay super.